mama Turn your lamp down low Wake up mama Turn your lamp down low Have you got the nerve to drive a good papa from your door? You know my mama died and left me restless Daddy died and left me wild, wild, wild Mama left me restless Daddy died and left me wild Well I ain't good looking but I'm some sweet woman's angel child And I once loved a woman better than I ever seen I once loved a woman better than I ever seen Treated me like a king and she was a doggone queen Sister, get your mother, mother, get your uncle, uncle, get your cousin, cousin, get your friend. I'm going up the country, mama, don't you want to go? May take me a pretty gal and might take two or three more. Well, Big A, he left Savannah. Would not stop, you should have seen that fireman when they got the boiler hot to reach over in the corner, mom, and hand me my traveling shoe. You know by that I've got them states full blue. Well, mama got them, papa got them, sister got them, brother got them, stepmom got them, Zach's got them. I woke up this morning and I had those states blue Looked over in the corner and find Willie MacTell had him too Many interesting little chord things happened, left th hand things happened in that version of Statesboro Blues. So let me go through them one at a time and, and show them to you because a lot of them are moves that can be made in lots of other tunes in detuning. For example, at the very beginning, I stuck on this little introduction that's kind of stolen from Skip James, who often played in a detuning, except it wasn't exactly the same as this one, but pretty close. And I did this thing on the second and third strings where I walked it down like that. Now you can do that and also get this first string. And you can, um, you can make licks out of that. It can also be like this. This is a turnaround. So that's just a generic turnaround you could do in a blues. And then go to the A7, you know, the five chord. And Skip James used it and, and several tunes use that, but it's, you know, this is also just a D7, if you do that, and a pretty one. So that was one thing. Um, let's see, this, at one point in this tune, well, there's this little pull-off lick on the first string, which was used all through the tune in the middle and at the end. And at the end of every verse, I played that and added to it this thing here, which was just just another little turnaround lick. Now, at one point during the singing, when the voice goes up, I ain't good looking, but I'm... It, the, the melody follows it, when the guitar follows it with the melody. And this move up here, there's a lot of detuning songs, arrangements, famous arrangements that are played uh, up here. Because you can reach all kinds of high notes up here. kinds of possibilities up there out of that position. Good for lots of tunes. So that happened. Then another thing that happened in the tune uh, was, of course, this, this little, little lick on the uh, fifth string, the A, walking down to an A seventh. There was also a little walk up to the G chord. Every time I went, almost every time I went to the G chord, I walked up to it like that. And, and uh, while we're on the subject, there's another standard turnaround 
where you just walk down the fifth string like that. A lot of 12 bar blues is, you know, Elmore James played slide guitar, but he played in this tuning uh, most of the time. Whenever he played slide, he was in detuning. And he, he would use that turnaround a lot. And you know what else he would do, which you can do in this tuning, which we should mention before I forget about it? You can do your boogie woogie licks like this on the bottom two strings and make them movable. And that goes all the way up to here. So those are standard blues detuning moves. But getting back to Statesboro blues now. There was one other section of the tune where I played little octaves on the sixth and fourth string. And I stopped my usual picking pattern to do that so I could just pick, you know, just for the first uh, four bars of the tune and then it goes back to the G and does everything as it usually did. Talking about the right hand, except for that little octave lick, it's almost always, you always had this thumb alternating on six and four or, or five and four when we were on the G chord. But even through all those turnarounds and everything else, it just keeps going. See, it stopped alternating just for a second to do that bass run, but then it's right back into it. So I'm going to uh, slow it down a little bit, split the screen for you so you can see what both hands are doing in detail, and go through the several little sections of that tune. The, uh, the what's happening during the verse and uh, what's happening during the little sections where I just went way up the neck to the 12th fret and just was doing this. Um, and then that little octave thing on the 6th and 4th string. So there's, I have to go through a couple of verses to show you all that. And here's the split screen version, slowed down, of Statesboro Blues. I once loved a woman better than I ever seen, seen, seen. Once loved a woman better than I ever seen. Treated me like a king and she was a doggone queen. Left Savannah, won't you would not stop You ought to see the fireman rolling When he got the boiler hot Reach over in the corner, mama Hand me my traveling shoes You know by that I got the states blues Well, mama got him Papa got him Sister got him Brother got him I got them. I woke up this morning, I had the States World Blues. Looked over in the corner, and Grandma and Grandpa had them too. 